It's Saturday morning, fantastic sunny morning in Otley. Blue skies, lovely sunshine, water flowing over the weir. Waitrose coffees, free. Just been reading about the swans and that, that some of them fly thousands of kilometres and come to the UK from like the Arctic and things for the winter. The Buick swans and things. And some of them fly high up, like thousands of feet up. Got the old light there, look, on the bridge, middle of the bridge. B formation of geese up there, look. There they go. And then here, all the waterfowl. Fantastic swans, look at those, look at the size of that. You think they they can fly, they're, so I think they're one of the heaviest birds that can fly. And, they, and they're not, they don't just fly short distances, they fly thousands of miles, you know. And there's a signet there that's just starting to turn fully white, look. turning white, it's getting this, losing its brown feathers and starting to go a bit white. So we're coming up to the weir now. So they have been repairing the boarding work on this, the wooden boards, and they're obviously in the middle of painting it now to blend it all in with the green colour on there. And this is the old entrance to the Lido and volunteers are just slowly trying to like uh, improve it and all that and get it open again. Claire, he's busy painting it, look. So it's the sort of entrance to the Lido and then there's boarding here on the Lido and they're trying to, just through volunteer effort and um, raising money and things are trying to get it ready like to try and reopen it at some point it's still all defunct though <laughs> that's what these boardings are about let's see friends of Otley Lido they're trying to get a feasibility study The circular route but the opposite way around the way we normally do it in direction of travel and we're nearly back now where the car park is next to that Italian restaurant uh, we're just going to go in front of these buildings here and then we'll be there the hydropower is still broken still off not working so all that energy has been wasted and look at that where it's been hit by massive logs it's all bent them from there Yeah, not operating. So it's Saturday morning, um, we're at, the library's open today, look. But um, when I was here yesterday, uh, these just had like one plant in the middle and today they've all been planted up, look, with the flowers. So all these flower plants have been planted up today with a new winter bedding. And you can see they've got the, the things here where they've been doing it. So yeah, amazing, isn't it? The sort of community spirit and things and what to do all that. So Eve's just got to get a flu jab and COVID jab. There's the doctors there. So 
Eric Knight's creative lassie was born in Mentor. There we go. This is the library. So you borrow jigsaws or you can complete one that's on, in progress. Lovely and warm in here. bowling club behind the doctors and I've just been into the Menston community fridge where you can go and get free f um, stuff there's just a few there's like these lovely bread buns and that left over and they're delighted that you were in there and it was just there was, there was only a few things left which was that and like you know a couple of like a bit of lettuce so um, yeah it's popular and it's just to stop the landfill uh, they get the leftovers from supermarkets and things and they just stop the landfill it's not for people, it's not like a food bank for just the poor. So, um, yeah, got fruit. Looks like these are Morrison's buns. So maybe that's what Morrison's does now. Instead of selling them off cheap, they just uh, give them away to community groups.